retired firefighter has found a new way to give back by teaching kids how to play chess. All right, not in the traditional way, though. Judy Goldberg looks at how he's created a whole new learning tool for the 21st century. Teaching one of the oldest games to younger generations is something Joe Micchio enjoys doing. Chess is a, a thing that many parents uh, and teachers love to have their uh, kids play and because it engages so much in their mind. The former cop and retired FDNY firefighter created Quick Chess for Beginners as a way to learn the stimulating game on a smaller board with fewer pieces. Mikio says after learning Quick Chess, players can make the move to traditional chess. You move up to the Quick Chess board and play with all the pieces, and then once you're done with that, then you step up to the traditional chess board, which is on the other side. It all starts with the power of the pawn, the only piece that doesn't go backwards. If they get to all the way to the other side of the board, they can become whatever they want. It's like life. One of the games that you'll see at the upcoming Toy Fair wasn't created by Mattel or Nintendo or any other big time manufacturer. It was made by one of New York's bravest, a city firefighter who turned a favorite pastime into a possible new career. The game is called Quick Chess. It's a new way of playing chess in half the time. A friend of Mikio's asked him to make something up to teach her children to play chess. It was the birth of Quick Chess, a board game with less than half the squares of a traditional chess board and with no double rook, knights, or bishops. I didn't even realize the game would work as a game. I thought it would just be a simple looking environment to show how the pieces move. I was, frankly, I was surprised. All they need to know is how each piece moves, how they capture, and how to checkmate the other king. It was originally designed to teach children quickly how to play chess, huh. but it has an unexpected side effect mm -hmm. in that adult and experienced chess players yeah. find it a very exciting game. <laughs> Chess tailor-made for the Americans. We like everything fast, yeah. instant. This is an instant mind blast. Being a fireman, you have to be able to think quickly, and that's important if you want to save somebody's life or one of the brother firefighters. It's a smaller version of our beloved game that is a, on a plate on a board five by six. So of each of the pieces other than pawns, you mm. only have one. So that's the difference. So you learn a lot of strategy this way because you're keeping it simple. As we say, keep it simple, stupid. Exactly. And as its name suggests, it's quick chess. So the game is a lot quicker. So that's one of the objections of people playing chess that chess games can take five six hours it's a long game when you play in a smaller board obviously it's a lot more limited yet with all the same beauty and excitement of the game your move <laughs> when i saw this right away i said we teach chess in the, Man the manhattan chess club school and all the public schools in manhattan uh, and i feel gosh this would be the perfect tool to take to these public schools did you ever think you could play a game of chess in just 15 minutes? Well, some Glen Cove students recently found out that they could. Thanks to the ingenuity of Joe Micchio, inventor and New York City firefighter, quick chess is becoming Glen Cove's newest pastime. I thought uh, first about the quick chess, and I said, how can you play a game of chess in less than 15 minutes? And that's the goal of the game, is to play a game of chess? And 15 minutes or so? Yeah, that's why they call it quick chess. Wow. <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah. Honestly, don't feel too bad. I play, I I play chess a lot. I can go over here. Look at win, look. No, that's not one. I can move to the 